chocolate peanut butter squares. These are so delicious, they taste just like Reese's peanut butter cups. What you will need is salt, whipping cream, brown sugar, peanut butter, milk chocolate chocolate chips, confectionery sugar or icing sugar, and butter. You will also need a dish and wax paper. The first thing you want to do is start making your chocolate ganache topping. So pour your whipping cream into a pot and bring it to a light simmer. While your cream is heating up, pour your chocolate into a glass bowl. Or you can use plastic. I'll leave all the measurements in the description box. Once your cream's ready, pour it over your chocolate. Let it sit for two minutes before you start stirring. Keep stirring until the chocolate and the cream is fully combined. Once you're done mixing, set it aside while we make our peanut butter mixture. What you will want to do is add all the rest of the ingredients together. Mix everything together until it's well combined. When you're done mixing, it should look something like this. Line your dish with the wax paper so that you have an easy time taking out your squares after. Now you're going to want to add your peanut butter mixture. Spread it evenly and then use your hands or the bottom of a cup to press it firmly into the dish. You want to make sure you pack it down hard so that it doesn't fall apart when you take it out later. Now it's time to pour on your chocolate ganache. Try to spread it out as evenly as you can. Put the chocolate peanut butter dish into the freezer for at least half an hour. Take it out a half hour before you serve it and cut it. I just use a cutting board to help me flip it over and take it out of the dish. Now the only thing you have to do is take off the wax paper, grab a knife, and cut squares. You can cut them in any sizes that you'd like. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thanks so much for watching.